Hello there. My name is Martha Traherne, although most people call me Aunt Martha. I run the only authentic Victorian dining experience in the country. My son and I set it up eight years ago. And two years ago, we acquired an amazing group of people who are as committed as ourselves to taking this business as high as it can go. I have a fabulous team and we've got great ideas how we want to grow the business and increase the experience for our visitors. Now we also are a training establishment and young people have come to us for their apprenticeships. One talented young lady completed hers and she's part of our permanent team. We'd like to be able to help more. We've reached the point where the business is so successful that we are spending a lot of the time being full and so we need more space. Now in Victorian times it was very popular for those with money to go on the grand tour. The Orient, Egypt, India, so many places in the world that they would go and discover. They would take pictures, bring back food of the time, the recipes, the decor and of course the knickknacks and then have a room done up themed around it in their great house. Well back in the summer I decided it would be rather nice to offer my visitors the Grand Tour, or part of it anyway, without having to travel. In the grounds we had a tea pagoda used as a summer house for our visitors and I've had my outdoor servants refurbish it. It's now a function room able to seat up to 12 people. It came finished at the beginning of September and already within the last five weeks it's hosted a wedding breakfast, a leaving do, a baby shower and more birthdays than I can count. But what it has also shown us is it's very popular. Small family gatherings are often up to that 12 in number and everyone has loved being in a room by themselves, not in amongst everybody else doing their dining. And of course we decorate it up for the occasion. Now, I would like to add two more rooms to our collection at the moment. One themed around Egypt with a garden inspired by Egypt and one around East India and the Raj with its gardens. But to do that I need your help. It's a very Victorian idea, this crowdfunding. Investing in a small company like ours gives you lots of rewards. It helps us and it can help other young people. There are lots of different things you can gain out of it, but probably the ultimate is if you sponsor one of those two rooms, say for example Egypt, and you are the sole people paying for it, the big mural that's going to be on the wall would be done in the Egyptian style, with you as the pharaoh and an attendant or wife. So why not think about immortality, along with all the other rewards that go with it? But remember, when you do, you're helping us to help young people to gain an education, to develop themselves, to have the opportunities. It's a Victorian idea that fits in the modern world. Thank you for listening to this, and I hope for investing in our dream. Thank you.